Good morning, welcome to the birthday vlog. I'm so happy to be back, I missed you guys so much. This is not my usual camera because the quality is so much better, but I'm using my cousin's camera and I'm like obsessed with the quality, so I think I might just have to switch. But my camera, as you know, it broke, so it's still getting fixed. But I wasn't gonna do anything crazy for my birthday and then I decided like two days ago that I wanted to do something. So I'm gonna do dinner tonight and then we also got this like luxury mini bus thing. So I'm excited, it's just like four of us or five. So it's just gonna be a small little intimate get together. But if you guys remember my birthday vlog last year, it was so lit. So I'm gonna leave the link here right now so you guys can watch it. The outfit is actually really cute, I'm gonna show you. So this is my outfit of the day. This set is from Amazon actually, it's really cute. This headband is from Amazon. Yeah, I haven't even showed you guys my room before but i'm slowly cleaning it but yeah we are gonna head to fortino's to pick up some flowers for my photos then we're gonna go pick up Brittany and linda and then we're gonna go drive to toronto and then go to the airbnb so i will see you guys there this birthday feels like really refreshing i don't know i feel like i'm in a new era of my life especially because i'm growing closer with my faith so I just feel very like light and just not worried about anything. Normally my birthdays, I'm always stressed about like getting the cake, getting this, getting that. But like today just feels very calm and I'm just going to take it day by day. And I'm excited to be back posting. I feel like I took a long break, but I need that time to really kind of figure out my life and myself and as I get closer to my 20s I feel like I'm really taking a lot of time to analyze you know everything that I've done this year and I just feel so blessed and so happy so thank you guys for being a part of my journey but yeah I'm so excited to take you guys through my birthday vlog and I guess I'll see you guys later bye uh no I don't on credit please <laughs> So we just arrived at Brittany's house and then we're gonna head to Linda's. We already got gas, we got the flowers in the back. They look so cute. And we're gonna head over to Toronto, pick up the cake. And let me see, I wanna show you guys like what the cake is gonna look like. It's so cute. Oh, there's mom. So cute. It's done, let me see. Well, no, it's not it. Oh. She's here, if you wanna help. Oh. Okay. Is that door open? Oh. Oh, are you? Good. Good. Hi vlog. We meet again. I'm back. <laughs> we're on the road. It's Mo's birthday and we're going out. Like we're always in the streets. <laughs> not the streets. No, we're not for the streets. We're just in the streets. I'm going out. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, so I will be taking you guys along for the day showing you what we're up to it's going to be a good day trust me it's going to be a good day we'll catch up with you later say hi to the vlog hi <laughs> Oh, it's so pretty. He did that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be right back, you ladies. Thank you. Bring up the cake, and then we're gonna head to the Airbnb and yes, <laughs> Cake is secured. <laughs> That's the hard part, though. The transporting. Yeah. Be careful. <laughs> we have made it to the Airbnb. The girls are just checking in. They're bringing in all the luggages and stuff. So that's why it's like a mess right now. Um, I'm just waiting to get the fob so I can go to the parking park and then go up to the Airbnb, do a little house tour. I'm so excited. Um, so, oh my gosh, I want to show you guys. Poor girls. Like they. you see them right now? Oh, currently they are checking in for me, taking all my stuff. Because it's my birthday, I don't need to do all that. But I'm really excited. So we are having dinner tonight at Black and Blue. I've never been there before. It's like a steakhouse. It's really fancy, really cute. And then we're having a bus thing pick us up. So that's going to be really nice. Yeah, no, that is pretty much it. I'm going to park and then I will show you guys the house once we get in. Bye! Now I get to go into the Airbnb. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think it was this. Okay. 
I could be totally wrong. No, I, I'm wrong. You can forget. What was I the was name? I think a four and two. Oh. oh, wait. I think it's here. Oh, perfect. <laughs> The TV crew Oh! Oh! Yeah. Wow! Yeah! It's so pretty. Wow. I put everything in the... Oh! Perfect. She's on it! That's perfect! You guys are casually waiting. Wow! This is nice! <laughs> Ooh! Oh, yes. Okay, so we got one bedroom here. We got this beautiful you. landscape, gorgeous, stunning, the black exterior. Oh my goodness. It's gonna look so nice at night. Yeah. It's gonna look so nice. Man, I'm like an expert. Oh, I know. Well, I am just so good. good. Yeah, you know Actually, you're planning my wedding. Yeah, no. <laughs> I will I'm happily. I will happily. Oh, wow. I didn't get to see that. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Three. Three full bedrooms, lighting, everything. Let's see what the next one looks like. Oh my. And the bathrooms. Wait. Oh, not bad. Not too shabby. It's pretty. It's pretty. Yeah. Oh, balcony on this one. Is there two balconies? Yeah. Two balconies. Bro, the price was a steal <laughs> and free parking. Oh, makeup. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm thinking I'm gonna do makeup here. Oh, yes, with the Boy, background. Light. Yeah, yes. that'd be so pretty. We need some light. Take it over, please. This is so pretty. I love this. Is it Not at all. Well, that's what I would thought. Cottage. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it was, and then it just didn't seem it like birthday vibe. It felt more like retreat. So I was like, you know what? I don't need no cake or nothing. No. <laughs> this is more birthday. This is more birthday. Yeah. Okay, we've checked in. Hi. I think we can order something that way. In the meantime, we're getting ready. We can eat. We just checked in. I like to put how everything's in it. It makes everything look so clutter, but better. Yeah. I didn't know! I was like, no, I will not be needing that. You have all the Okay, we'll see you guys later. Bye! I knew that three was up to be like just a five for you. I thought I liked you that bitch like you with all the more problems you can do. I'm not. As long as you're joking, now it's for me. I ain't got it. We're about to get more together for her birthday. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, the BTS is the BTS. This is too no, I wobbled, that's Perfect. why. Alright, ready to get away? I'm ready. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> the background is giving like New York. Yep. Yeah, it looks okay. so <laughs> Oh my god, we should order food! Again! Oh my god! <laughs> you look so this is 
top one. one. This Has is number, number one. one. This is number one. I can't even like this is number one. Oh my god! And I think the lashes. The l I love the eyes. They're you're just, right. You're like they're very like sexy, like, yeah. sultry, grown. camera that died. Yeah. It died. She's down. She's down. Oh, The birther girl looking stunning. Cheers. <laughs> Brittany. I know I miss Janine too. I miss her. She's getting spirit. Yes. <laughs> She's right there. Yep. Alright, I'm done. It's dark and down inside me. I'm not gonna shake. Been stressed for so long. So stuck in my own way. So I enjoy this moment. It's the day that the Lord has made. I thought it was That looks delicious. Um, I might have a little bit. But I don't know my lips. <laughs> Number one ever. Yeah, this look. That's my favorite. Takes a cake. Takes yeah. a cake. I thought last time was the best. This time. Yeah. Was this better. is. I'm like completely blown away. But every time. Just... Anyways, made it back. I am. <laughs> we made it back. Um. Yeah. The camera battery died. So and then we spent like an hour taking photos on the bus. And now we're here. Okay, I'm gonna show you some of the photos. They look so cute. These photos look how gorgeous. Oh, oh, you're smart. You're smart. You're smart. <laughs> look how gorgeous these photos are. I was like falling asleep at dinner, but it was like very nice. Now I'm gonna take some photos with my cake. No, oh, as long as it's it's safe, right? Yeah. It's <laughs> I'm like it's safe. But yeah, we just up in our con down. Can't wait to sleep, but this face is like amazing, so I don't want to take it off. I don't want to take it off. But we're gonna take some photos. 
pictures and yeah. Yeah, no pictures. That could be our actual chill time. Yeah. <laughs> Like this? Because we can still use the parking lot here. We yes. Pack everything, check out. <laughs> and she's like, what? The face! What? How can I take this I face like, off? No, Help me! Help me! <laughs> okay. Okay. Wait, that's not center. There we go. <laughs> wow. That's enough. I don't know if I did that right. I think you did. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know what I was doing. Also. Okay, we just took out this hair. Now I'm going to try to take off this face, but it's so cute. Oh, no, no, no. I'm the same way. I just like to have... Oh, gosh. Hi. 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 Okay, let me get cozy. Oh, gosh. This out the way. Oh, my gosh. So, it is currently almost four o'clock on the dot 4 a.m december 12th and my birthday is now done it was such a fun time but i do feel like i was so exhausted so i didn't get to like enjoy it as much as i wanted to and i think because of all the trips that i've had just one after the other like i'm just completely out but today was a fun birthday i feel like last year i like posted it and i did a lot more than this year but not that this wasn't like special, but I just feel like I'm just in a new era of my life. And I feel like, especially with my journey with God, I'm growing closer to him. And certain things that used to be important to me aren't as important to me. So it's kind of like I'm transitioning. Like even this birthday, normally I make my birthday a, like a big deal. Not that it isn't a big deal, but certain things I would stress about getting a certain this or certain that. I kind of just went with the flow, which was kind of fun, but also just different for me. But yeah, I didn't post it at all. And it was kind of interesting because normally I'm like, okay, I want to post my birthday so everybody knows it's my birthday. But this year was kind of like the people that knew messaged me. I don't know, new era, whatever. But yeah, I just feel like I've been reflecting a lot more with God and just on this very important journey with him. It's just been so different. And even with my break with content, I'm kind of transitioning into what type of content I wanna post and talk about. And I feel like I'm becoming more faith driven, which is what he wants and it's what I want and my heart is changing. So it's just interesting. And just thinking about this entire year, I feel like October, November, December, like this has been my biggest transition months and the beginning of the year, I was really caught up with work. I was planning events, I was traveling, I was doing a lot of things. And then as soon as everything stopped, it was kind of like I focused just with God. So I don't know, I'm very excited for this new journey. I'm like a little bit nervous because it's, I feel completely different than the person I was last year, but in a good way. And the year before that, I felt like a completely different person. So it's like I'm becoming this new person and still thinking about the old person, but also focusing on who I am. Just interesting, but I feel like that's your journey with faith. It's always gonna be up and down. It's always gonna be a roller coaster, but you have to remember that he is for you. He has a plan for you and God will provide everything. It's just interesting. There's just been a lot that happened this year and a lot that I didn't reflect on. And I feel like I don't take time to appreciate my accomplishments and God was showing me, the, showing me this the last few months because it was always like okay I did this what's next I was on a panel what's next I want to play an event what's next and then as soon as everything stopped it was like okay God was like if I keep giving you more you're not going to appreciate what I have for you so I need you to slow down and realize that everything that I have for you is going to be there you just need to slow down so I kind of feel like that's where I'm at and also I'm like tiptoeing into it because I'm like okay god I want to do this and he's like I told you to slow down so you need to just relax I feel very different in a good way my heart is changing and just certain things that I used to do if it's listening to like secular music I would listen to something now and like immediately feel like the spirit telling me to turn off so certain lifestyle changes I'm kind of going through and also focusing on my body and my physical health because I've been sick the last two months more than ever this entire year and it's really made me appreciate taking care of my body and especially with a career where it's 
consistently up and down. Being an entrepreneur can be so overwhelming and you don't realize how much pressure you put on your body and your mind and your spirit and everything. So I think actually putting my health first, which I've never done and I never, you see healthy and even work out, it would always be up and down. But this time I feel like I'm working on because I want to be healthy and I want to be able to handle what God has for me next year. So I'm growing closer to God. I'm growing closer, closer to my goals. I'm seeing more depth in my friendships and my faith with my friendships and relationships and my family even. It's like faith is kind of, oh, I'm running out of storage. Ah. I don't even know where I was talking about, but yeah, I just feel like I'm in this new pre presence of God like something I've never felt before in my entire life. It feels like finally at peace with everything. And even though there is gonna be you know, trials and things that you're gonna go through, it's like I always have the sense of peace and it's kind of like overwhelming in a sense. But I always wondered like how people feel when they walk with God and I'm like, wow, this is how you feel. Like you wake up and feel so peaceful and in your relationships, everything just feels so like surreal. And just remembering like this isn't the end, like earth isn't the end and just even the things I used to focus on, not that I was like overly obsessed with like materialistic things, but just things that I used to put first before God. Now I'm like, wow, like it, it doesn't even, nothing even matters because at the end it's just you and God and your eternity. So really, I really want to focus more on I don't know, just being able to express how I feel when it comes to my faith. I feel like, not that I used to shy away from it, but now I'm understanding more of it. So I definitely want to, I don't know, that's kind of who I am. That's who is me. And I want to showcase that because this is who I am. And I want to show my life. 27, is that crazy or what? That I've been able to grow such a beautiful and amazing audience i was kind of like slowly introducing my faith on instagram and like the broadcast channel also you should definitely join but basically just like you get notifications so i was able to just you know spread how i'm feeling spread like little prayers and a lot of people messaged me and said that they resonated with that so i feel like okay god is like giving me the confidence to finally share the word and share my journey yeah this birthday has been beautiful. I hope you guys enjoyed this birthday vlog. Um, yeah, I'm excited to see where this next journey takes us. And I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye! Oh, my body could sleep for a day or two. Oh, <laughs> see, I wish I could do that. Yeah, I... I Even can't. when I'm sick, I can't sleep for like 12 hours. Really? Yeah. Just my body says no. Wow. The sun is shining. And we're literally in the clouds. God's like right there. <laughs> He's like, yo, what's up, bro? I'm in the neighborhood. I'm in your city. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, just look at how it's moving. And the waves are just waving. Who you do? I better move a be proud for you. Good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. It's daylight and we are still in this beautiful condo. It's giving penthouse sweet. Um, we have a lot of cleaning to do. Oh my gosh, look at the sun. I managed to scrub off all the beautiful makeup from yesterday. It's very depressing, but it's fine. Um, yeah, I could get used to this view. Like this is, uh, this is the light right now. So oh, all these balloons are gonna have to be popped. And I think we're going to try to go to brunch. No, I think we are going to brunch. We just have to figure out our parking situation. But it's my first day of being like, actually, no, it's my second day of being 27. So um, this is a new era. This is a new era. But look at this view. New era. And this is how everything's looking. So yeah, I'm gonna do some cleaning and we gotta pack. And then I will definitely see you at brunch. Here's some of the photos yesterday. I had like technical difficulties with these, but these ones came out cute. So, oh my gosh, my nail fell off. That's funny. Anyways, it's been real. 
probably see you guys at brunch. And I'll talk to you later. Come back. Gosh, that sun is hitting nice. Let me post my balloons. I met a man with a friend. Like Weezy Mark Ingram Pizza. Eating up the center. It's a soul die. She can see the difference from her own eyes. Yeah, but she not used to not having somebody around. Don't know how to spend her alone time. Okay, we are gonna be walking to brunch. It's looking, oh, it is open. Okay, everyone's, everyone's eating in there. <laughs> Not loud and dead. I can see you want me to. It's me and you now. Uh, I've been waiting, they don't wanna make a move. <laughs> Two-turn, baby girl, you know me. 